Next question is from an Orthodox Fitness Me. What is one thing that each of you does on a daily basis as far as general maintenance for your body or something to improve on the daily? Hmm. Uh, I mean, the easy one is 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 exercise and working out. Mm -hmm. um, you know, I on a very consistent basis. You know, luckily I have a, a gym in the garage, and I go out there and I do something. Um, so some I typically will alternate between. <laughs> heavy workouts. And then the days in between is when I go out there and I just touch body parts with lighter exercises, or I'm working on full range of motion, or I'm doing things that work on my mobility. But I would say that's probably the most consistent thing that I do. Now, the other thing I started adding is I'm trying to make more of an effort to have some kind of a daily spiritual practice. Um, I think the necessity of that is just higher now. I think mm. the, the you know, kind of what everybody's going through, I find way more value in having a, a daily, you know, spiritual practice. So I'm, I'll watch preachers or pastors or spiritual leaders talk. Um, and, and, you know, I, I normally, I just, it makes me feel better because a lot of the messages that I'm, that tend to come across and you find this common among all most uh, you know, popular spiritual practices is this message of acceptance, but they, they they present it in different ways. And I find that the message of acceptance is helping me the most right now. So as, as of right now, that's something that I'm, you know, making effort. I would say uh, mobility and reading for me. Uh, those There's a lot of days that go by that I don't get a lift in. Like uh, I, I'd like to, to say that every day I'm training and lifting weights, but the reality is, is I'm not. Um, and But what I'm really good about is you know there's a handful of uh, movements from our Maps Prime Pro that have just been life changing for me. Uh, in fact, I got tagged on a post uh, the other day. Um, somebody tagged me because Mark Bell was showing that he couldn't get down in a full squat, and somebody tagged me and said you should you know talk to Adam. And you know his response was he's been friends with Kelly Starrett for you know decades and still can't doesn't believe that he can do it. And I, I was in the same camp. I thought the same thing about myself. I didn't think that uh, I would ever be able to get down in a, you know, bottom squat and sit there comfortably. It just it, the little bit of effort I'd put towards it just never felt like it. I was in pain and uh, didn't feel like it was possible. But you know, it took a it took a few years of being very very consistent and and I'm very mindful of the the work that it took to get to where I'm at now that I appreciate it so much that I make sure to do a few of these mobility drills every single day just to kind of say it. And I know that even if I just put a few minutes of effort towards them, that I'll keep that range of motion up, which has just been life-changing for me. I mean, I had bursitis in my hips. I had chronic low back pain all the time. Even though I was buff and looked good, uh, I felt kind of miserable. And that's been gone for two years now. And so I've made it a daily practice to to always, you know, hit my 90-90, hit some combat, uh, hit some thread the needles. Like there's a handful of movements that, you know, that we have in Prime Pro that I made like a ritual to always make sure that I do. Uh, and then the other thing would be reading, uh, whether that be like articles, uh, newsletters, or diving into the books that I'm reading or listening to. Uh, try and make a, a practice of that, even if it's for just a short period of time, uh, being consistent with that. Uh, that's one of the the single uh, most important things that I have found with continued growth for myself. Uh, so those two practices, I'd say, uh, I've been really good about always making sure that's a daily practice, and then I'm striving to uh, make sure that I have my workouts. But the reality is, those don't always happen. Uh, but the reading and the mobility does. Yeah, I've definitely ritualized uh, certain mobility moves uh, on a daily basis, mainly because of recognizing how my habits had changed based off of, you know, what do you do, what I do for a living now? I'm not up uh, re-racking people's weights. I'm not uh, walking around constantly. And so I'm sitting in the chair or I'm sitting in my truck or, you know, lots of sitting. So like half the day, um, I'm, I'm trying to be very mindful of sitting in a squat. I'm, I'm either in Seiza or I'm in 90-90 or I'm, you know, down in Pigeon before the boys or the dogs attack me, you know, mm -hmm. and, and I'm basically down there and then just doing my thing, whether the TV's on, whether I'm, uh, you know, like at home or I'm here, I, if, if there's an opportunity for me to kind of sit in, in sort of a mobility pose or yoga pose or something I can do to restore my hips 
and uh, you know, my shoulders getting rotation out of my shoulders constantly because that's something that if I don't do that, I can just feel uh, the stiffness and and you know the pain uh, as a result of when I go back to lifting weights, uh, all that stuff. Uh, you know, you, you start to feel that uh, intensify, and so I'm just very mindful of constantly moving my body and trying to keep uh, you know that you know oiled like a well oiled machine. Uh, and you know, in, in terms of that, like. I, I intentionally try to take everyone in the family out on a walk, and this is something that Courtney sort of helped me with. Uh, every time I'm home, is is we get out and we go walk, and we it doesn't matter where we go. We have trails near my house. There's a, a field that we go a lot of times to take the dogs, but I use that time to rough house with the kids. But then also we just connect and we're able to talk, uh, you know, and communicate a lot better when we're active and moving together as opposed to sitting and trying to recap people's days. So that's definitely something I always do. 